Good morning, and welcome to Morning Manna. Today is Thursday, January the 2nd, 2020, and this is episode 3192. My name is Bruce Turner. Welcome to today's Morning Manna. Today's episode is titled, Hold On. Stay tuned. So I graduated high school in 1968, and I was part of a period of time, uh, a really great awakening. I think some would refer to it as a second great awakening, uh, something that was referred to often as the Jesus movement uh, back in the 60s. And um, I bought my first guitar uh, in 1969 and uh, just began to find uh, great joy in music and expressing my faith. In 1971, a contemporary Christian band called Ocean uh, came out with a song that became quickly one of my favorites, and it really inspires what I want to share with you today. The song was titled, Put Your Hand in the Hand. (laughs) And the song goes like this. Put your hand in the hand of the man who stilled the water. Put your hand in the hand of the man who calmed the sea. Take a look at yourself, and you can look at others differently. Put your hand in the hand of the man from Galilee. That's my encouragement to you today. On the second day of January, as we continue to step into a brand new year, put your hand in the hand of the man who stilled the water. Now, I like all kinds of music, including bluegrass music. I loved going to bluegrass jams. And there's another great, great bluegrass song titled Hold to God's Unchanging Hand. Let me share with you the lyrics from that song. Time is filled with swift transition. Naught of earth unmoved can stand. Build your hopes on things eternal. Hold to God's unchanging hand. Trust in him who will not leave you whatsoever years may bring. If by earthly friends forsaken, still more closely to him cling. When your journey is completed, when the valley you pass through, fair and bright the home in glory, your enraptured soul will view. And the chorus, hold to God's unchanging hand. Hold to God's unchanging hand. Build your hopes on things eternal. Hold to God's unchanging hand. Hold on to God's hand. Hold on. Put your hand in the hand of the man who stilled the waters. Why would you not do that? Think about this. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or nakedness or peril or sword As it is written, for your sake we are killed all day long. We are accounted as sheep to the slaughter. Yet, yet in all these things we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. For I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any other created thing shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Put your hand today in the hand of the man who stilled the waters. Hold to God's unchanging hand. Hold on. Father, thank you that even when we're not holding on, you're holding on to us. Lord, give us the strength to have a tight 
grip on your hand to lead us, to guide us, to strengthen us, to comfort us, to provide for us, to give us wisdom and strength, peace, direction. In Jesus' name, amen. Our website is morningmana.com. A really simple site, I must say. Just very simple. Just a place where you can look at all the episodes. My email address, bruceturner at gmail.com. Thanks for listening. Have a great day. Till tomorrow morning, this is Bruce reminding you to choose joy. Joy.